Hello students, I am Bhavya. Welcome to my channel Bhavya Physics. Today we are going to discuss most important questions of first PU chapter 1 units and measurement. So weightage of this lesson is 3 to 4 marks. <clears throat> so the most important questions of 2 marks is write fundamental physical quantities in SI system. The answer is mass in kg, length in meter, time in second, temperature in Kelvin, amount of substance in mole, luminous intensity in CD candela and uh, the last one is luminous intensity in candela, amount of substance. Okay. So these are the important physical quantities. Next mention two supplementary units that is uh, radian and steradian. Radian, RAD, steradian, yes sir. Mention any two uses of dimensional analysis. The, there are three uses. Dimensional analysis is used to check the correctness of an equation. It is used to convert one system of units into another system. And uh, it is used to derive the relationship between physical quantities. You can write any two. And sometimes this question is also asked for three, uh, three marks. So you know down all the three uh, applications. And next one is write dimensional formula for See, force and pressure is very important, but you can also expect the dimensional formula for other physical quantities. So, what is the dimensional formula? Force. It is very uh, important. Just remember this always. Uh, dimensional formula force is M L P to the power minus 2. And pressure is force per area. So, that, that's why it is divided by L square. Then it becomes M L to the power minus 1 t to the power minus 2. Okay, m l to the power minus 1, t to the power minus 2. Next question is limitations of dimensional analysis. When we are uh, checking the correctness of equation, say half, if there is a number, number or half is there means we cannot check the correctness of equation, okay, if there is a numbers, okay. So, dimensional analysis fails to uh, derive the relationship between physical quantity if there is a logarithmic function, trigonometric functions, okay, and or exponential functions are there. So, you just write any two limitations to so practice that, that is one of the important questions. Next, three marks questions. Check the correctness of equation. So, the equations may be these three or these three, you know, you have studied in mechanics chapter uh, and this one, in straight line, uh, motion in a straight line, you have studied this equation. And F is mv square by R, centripetal force. And half mv square is mgh, that is kinetic energy is equal to potential energy. Checking the correctness, one of the equation you can expect, okay, for 3 marks. And show that 1 joule is 10 to the power 7 or, or 1 newton is 10 to the power 5 dyne, you may expect for 3 marks. Please go through these, okay. And I have... Uh, solved all these and I uploaded the video related to this and I'll uh, send you the link of this video. In description box link will be given please go through that and important 5 marks questions are derive the relationship among the physical quantities. The expected 3 relations are one is time period okay time period of simple pendulum another one is frequency of stretched string Another one is centripetal force. Please go through that. All these are very important derivations. So sometimes this derivation is also asked for 5 marks. In numerical problem this derivation may are added. Okay this is asked for 5 marks. But most of the time they will ask a total of 3 marks or 4 marks question from this lesson. Yes, students, if you have any confusion regarding this video or regarding this concept, this chapter, you can comment in the comment section and see you in next video. Thanks for watching.